Hey, Mark Rice here to show you how to create this beautiful animation of the forest and other details as well. And if you want to learn more about game design, animation and game development, check out the 100 games project. Ok, so as you can see here I have the small forest created just from a couple of different trees. Here I have the layers for the trees, shadow and the background. So first select all the layers. Ok, click with the right mouse button and create shapes from vector layers. Ok, now I just got the new layers, so I need these layers and I will delete the old ones, something like this. Ok, cool. First I will select the tree 1 layer, so this is for the first tree. Ok, then click with the right mouse button on the layer, go into effect distort and UCC Bandit. Ok, beautiful. Now when I isolate the tree, as you can see here I need to fix this. So first go into the layer, then Effect, CC Bandit and select the Bend. Then move the lower point here at the bottom of the tree and the upper point on the top of the tree, something like this. You can move it up a bit. Ok, beautiful. Now go on the first frame and create the first keyframe. Ok. Just a moment. And it can be minus 5 for example. Ok, cool. And here I will create the second keyframe and it will be 5. Ok. Now, as you can see, I have this movement, but I need the loop of it, so select these keyframes, hit F9 for the smooth animation, ok, then go here, hold out and click this stopwatch icon, ok, here type loop, out, ping pong, ok, cool. Now let me check. Ok. Beautiful. Ok, basically that's it. Now I want to copy this on other trees as well. So, select Bandit. Ok, copy it with Ctrl plus C. Then go on the first frame here. Select other trees and paste it with Ctrl plus V. Ok. Ok, we have a little mess here, but don't worry about it. So. Now select all the three layers and hit U keyboard button. So as you can see now I have my keyframes. Then select the bend for the second tree and here move this point. And basically this is everything what you need to do. Then select the bend for the next tree. Okay. Now it's ok. And bend for the last tree. Ok. Ok, and for now we have this. Look at this, it's a beautiful animation. But it can be even better. If I move this keyframe a bit. Ok. Let me check. <laughs> it's much better. And you can implement the same technique for other elements as well. Ok guys, that's it for today. I hope that you liked the tutorial. And this is my gift for you. It's very useful, so use it, ok? And huge love to my Patreon community. Guys, thanks for the support. So, that's it for today. If you like it, subscribe or join our community. And stay tuned, because the best is yet to come. Oh yeah. Peace.